Good morning children. Children, today we will continue our exercise 3.5 Word Problems Based on Addition. In our last video children, we have discussed question number 1, question number 4 and question number 6. Question number 3 and 5 was your homework. I hope all of you have solved. Okay, very nice. Children, today I will send the solution of question number 3 and question number 5 along with the attachment. Now today we will start solving question number 7. Let's start. Question number 7 is children. A company manufactured 3562 motorbikes in the first year, 2693 motorbikes in the second year and 3139 motorbikes in the third year. Find the total number of motorbikes manufactured by the company in the three years. So children, you may see that in the first year, a company has manufactured how many? Yes, a company has manufactured 3,562 motorbikes. Now in the second year, company has manufactured 2,693 motorbikes. Now in the third year, children, company has manufactured 3139 motorbikes. Now you have to find out total number of motorbikes produced. Okay, so we will start writing the statement first. Number of motorbikes produced in the first year 3562. Number of motorbikes produced in the second year 2693. Number of motorbikes produced in the third year. 3139. So, total number of motorbikes produced. As we have to find out the total number of motorbikes, so we will do addition. So, write the 3562 first, then 2693 second and 3139 third. Now, you have to add here children. So, we will add in the rough column. So we are making here columns. You may see ones, tens, hundred and thousand and write numbers in the respective columns. So 3,562, 2,693 and 3,139. So when we add children, we are getting 9,394. So all total 9,394 bikes are produced in these three years. Clear? Now children move to next question that is question number 10. There are 4,675 men, 3,248 women and 1,968 children living in a town. Find the population of the town. Population means we will add these three men, women and children. Okay. So, when we will add, so that this addition will give the population of the town. Okay. So, children, you may see, tell me here, yes, what is the number of men? Number of men is 4,675. Number of women, 3,248. And number of children, 1,968. So children you have to find the total population. So we will add these three. First of all we will write the statements. Let's start. Number of men 4675. Number of women 3248. Number of children 1968. So total population is we will add these three numbers and we will do addition in the rough column here. Again, we will make here columns now. Ones, tens, hundreds, thousands. Write the numbers accordingly. 4,675, 3,248, 1,968. Okay. Now, we will add children. On addition, what we are getting? Yes, we are getting 9,891. So, our answer is, total population is 9,891. 91. Clear? I hope you are getting children. Okay. Now we move to the last question. That is question number 11. 
and the sum of the greatest three digit number and the smallest four digit number so children tell me what is the greatest three digit number yes very good it is 999 and what is the smallest four digit number yes it is 1000 very good so we have to find the sum sum means we will add okay the result of the addition is called the sum now so we have to add these two numbers clear so first of all we will write the greatest three digit number and the smallest four digit number let's start the statement children the greatest three digit number equal to 999 the smallest four digit number equals to 1000 so the sum is we will add these two 999 Plus one thousand, so we are getting one thousand nine hundred and ninety-nine. Okay, you will show addition in the rough column, children, as I have done. So the sum of greatest three-digit number and the smallest four-digit number is one thousand nine hundred ninety-nine. Okay, as we are finding the sum, so we are doing your addition. Clear, children? Okay. Now, children, your home assignment is. you will solve question number 8 and question number 9 in your notebook and you will solve these three questions also question number 7 10 and 11 in your notebook okay now in the next video i will send the solution also of question number 8 and 9 okay you can correct your answers also children okay now take care have a good day children thank you